I'm Jeff Alpin, The Big Game Hunter, and today we're going to talk about ending the interview and asking for the job. Now, asking for the job is one of those classic pieces of advice that recruiters offer, and no one really explains how to ask for the job. You never want to go into that situation by saying, please give me the job, I really want the job, or anything that can be interpreted in that way. Instead, asking for the job is really a euphemism for expressing interest. So I don't think it's appropriate at the end of the interview to say things like, um, I just, you know, I, I would be a perfect fit for this job. Um, you know, when are you going to hire me? Or, or words to that effect, or anything that can be interpreted in that same way. Instead, you want to express interest. So at the very end, when they have the opportunity uh, and they say to you, and this is the signal that they're wrapping up, so is there anything else? Uh, or are there any other points that you want to make? or something that indicates the wrap-up to the interview. Uh, I think the smoothest way to do it, and it has to be smooth, is to simply say, uh, I just want you to know how interested I am in this role. Have I answered all your questions? Is there anything else you know in order to feel comfortable um, uh, with me in this role? Um, is there anything that's left unaddressed uh, that you might want to ask me? Um, so in this way, you have, you've given them one more cut at, at asking you questions, and you've also expressed interest. And again, when they say, no, I think I've gotten everything, great. What would the next step be uh, in the hiring process, and when might I expect to hear back from you in one way or another? Um, well, I expect we're going to finish first-round interviews next week. We'll be back to you right after that. You know, as things stand now, how do I rank? Uh, because, again, I'm very interested. Now, that, that's a, a, a very blunt question, and it requires that they give you a candid assessment. To me, it's best that you know right then and there, but you don't have to necessarily be that blunt if you're not comfortable with it. Uh, you can simply, again, say, and, and, and I want to be clear, I am very interested in this role, um, and I look forward to hearing from you about next steps in the process. And if I heard correctly, and I know this isn't you know, cast in stone, because sometimes there are cancellations and reschedules, but I might expect to hear back from you at the end of next week. Yes, terrific. Thank you so much. Look forward to meeting you again and other people on the team. Again, the idea is to express interest. Uh, I happen to like that question uh, of, about where do I rank in the process uh, because uh, I'd rather have you get honest feedback than the kind of BS uh, where they don't respond back right away and it delays and it delays and you know, you're holding out hope and sometimes people make the mistake of freezing other interviews, waiting for that one thing. You keep going out there and interviewing until you have the offer in hand. Because uh, otherwise, you can get caught short. Uh, you can be misled by uh, someone who doesn't have the courage to be honest with you. And, and again, if they say to you, no, you, you did very, really well or you rank very highly, they're still not committing themselves to you, but at least you're getting good feedback saying you interviewed well. There may be reasons why they choose someone else that include you know, differences in compensation, um, personality and fit, and a variety of other things. But at least for now, you're getting feedback that you interviewed well. So again, um, to me, the best way to ask uh, for the job is to simply say, you know, I just want you to know how interested I am in this role. Um, what would the next steps be like? Uh, when would I expect to hear back? How do I rank um, amongst the other people that you've interviewed? So this is Jeff Alpin, The Big Game Hunter. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did and you're watching on YouTube, share it, leave a comment, click the like button, do something that indicates that this is worthwhile for you. I also want to encourage you, come over to my website, which is TheBigGameHunter.us. I have lots of great content, including all my YouTube videos, um, podcasts of Job Search Radio and No BS Job Search Advice Radio. Uh, you also can read previous articles I've written for my easing, receive a complimentary subscription to it. Uh, as, and, and actually, I have two easings, No BS Job Search Advice and No BS Hiring Advice easing, um, which are published the job search one is weekly. The other one is now twice monthly. Uh, they have advice for job hunters and hiring professionals uh, that are good anywhere in the world. 
These are places that you can post your resume to or post your job descriptions to. Information about my books and guides to job hunting, other people's books and guides, positions I'm recruiting for, places you can post your resume to. A lot of great content, including information about my coaching program, VIP Personal Search. So come over to TheBigGameHunter.us and go exploring. A few final things. If your firm's trying to hire someone, send me an email at Jeff Altman at TheBigGameHunter.us. Love to help you with, with staffing positions. If we're not already connected on LinkedIn, send me a connection request. LinkedIn.com forward slash IN forward slash the big game hunter. I accept connection requests from people worldwide, as long as your profile doesn't look like a spammer's profile. Finally, Finally, if you have a question for me about job hunting, I'm a live person, job search, and career coaching expert. Contact me through liveperson.com. That's L-I-V-E person.com. Be happy to answer your questions. This is Jeff Altman. Hope you have a great day. Take care.